they think they need to be particularly tough because the offences were committed by the Prime Minister, the most sen senior member of the government. They say there is no precedent for a Prime Minister having been found to have deliberately misled the House. So it's a moment of history. It's a line in the sand. They're creating a marker here. He misled the House on an issue of the greatest importance to the public and did so uh, repeatedly. So that's the first crime. The second crime, uh, he, they say, is he declined our invitation to reconsider his assertions that what he said to the House was truthful. In other words, they were also crossed because he refused to go back and correct the record. The point of being so tough on Boris Johnson is to send a signal that that kind of behaviour isn't good enough. And they also say that they were furious that when they sent uh, under conditions of strict confidentiality uh, their provisional report to Mr Johnson, he then leaked it. They're effectively trying to draw a line under the Boris Johnson era.